If you're one of God's waiters, you've got to realize that you can take credit for the service, but you can't take credit for the meal. Turn to your neighbor and say, neighbor, if you're one of God's servants, you can take credit for the service, but you can't take credit for the meal. What am I saying? What am I saying is if you are a waiter, when you bring that good food out there and lay it on the table and people start shouting just when you lay the food on the table. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Macaroni and cheese. When they start shouting because you laid the food, you can't start cheesing like you cooked it. You just serving it. And so if anybody start cheesing, it ought to be the chef that's in the kitchen. So instead of you taking the compliments, you ought to say compliments to the chef. I laid it on the table, but, but compliments to the chef. And so when you're doing ministry and people start patting you on the back and start blowing you up about how good you are, you better be careful and say, no, I'm just serving it. Compliments to the chef. So when you sing and folk fall out, say, say no, no, compliments to the chef. When you preach and people get saved, well, that sound good, but it wasn't on me. Compliments to the I'm just serving it, but the credit goes to the chef. I wish I had somebody in here today that would take five minutes to give the credit to the chef. Thank God for a good waiter. Thank God for a good waitress. Thank God for a good service. But the meal came from the chef. Compliments to the chef. Yes. 